When I first started small game hunting, I uh, picked up a shotgun, first shotgun I ever bought. It was uh, Harrington and Richardson Model 88. It was a 12 gauge with a full choke in it, single shot. And I bought it from a guy down the road. I think I paid $80 at the time, which was about $30 more than it was worth. But I carried that gun for a long time. Uh, I don't know how many squirrel partridge I shot with it. Then one day, like a fool, I decided to part with it and get something newer and nicer, I thought. but Well, anyway, this fall my son got his small game license. He passed his test, and we started going out squirrel hunting. And he was using a 22, wasn't having too much luck, because anybody that's ever hunted squirrels knows they're not like, you know, the squirrels at your feeder. You know, they have a way of disappearing out in the woods. They don't sit in one spot for long, so... So I decided that I was going to go get a 20 gauge shotgun for him to use. Uh, I have a pump 20 gauge, but I figured the small single shot would fit better. So I called up one of the gun shops I go to a lot, and he had a couple in. So I went down and took a look, and this is what he ended up having. That's a Harrington and Richardson Model 88. It's a 20 gauge, it's got a modified barrel. It's in fairly good shape, it locks up tight. And I actually ended up trading him a, he wanted $75, I ended up trading him a 12 gauge single shot like this, but it's the newer New England firearms. And he threw in two boxes of 20 gauge shells for it. So my son actually got his first squirrel with it, which was cool. And, uh, you know, I carried the gun a couple times in the woods, and I remembered, you know, like I said, I've been using a pump, but I remembered how nice the single shots carry, you know. They're lighter, they're shorter. So there were actually a couple times I wish he'd take his, he was would have taken his uh, 22 again. That way I could carry that. Well, the other week I went back to the same gun shop, and lo and behold, on the shelf he had a Harrington and Richardson Model 88 20 gauge. Well this one's got the full choke which I actually like better. So I ended up picking that up. I traded him a box of 25 Stevens Rimfire that I had. I have a rifle that chambers it but the gun's actually in worse shape than I thought so I had no problem parting with the ammo. And I gave him 60 bucks for that one. But, like I said, it's just those single shots that carry so nice. But, got a matching pair here. The back one's the modified choke, the front one's got the full choke. And I thought the price he was asking for him, you know, 75 for each. But like I said, I traded some stuff. I thought it was more than more than a good price. So 